Hi, I'm Graham. This is the Gorilla Store. So we're a small electronics and science-based store in the Ontario Science Centre. We carry all sorts of things uh, to help you build maker projects like electronics and wires and motors and gears, as well as general science products like optics. We're starting new chemistry kits soon, um, as well as all of the tools you need to really get started. No, these aren't Molex, these are inline couplers. So these, um, we have these for two reasons. One, it's a solder-free connection. Uh, you just wire in, wire in, tighten down the grub screws. But they also work really well as a mechanical linkage on axles. You can take the screws out, slide the sleeve out, and now you have two set screws on a round barrel. And are these, uh, what are these circuit boards? So we're, we are a, a growth from the old Active Surplus store. So we are staying true to a lot of its roots with recycled product and industrial offcasts. All of the boards we carry were destined for landfills or recycling. They're going to get chipped and ruined. But they're still, they're wonderful looking pieces and they're lots of fun, just, you know, you can turn them into art projects or things like that. But we also use them a lot to educate people about what technology and design looks like. Like, what was this board? What was it used for? How can we tell that just by reading the board? What are the evidences on the board that this was used for a particular industry. So, those are the kind of things that we like to carry. Oh, and I haven't seen these for a while. These are tubes. Yes. And they're, they're, they're just work like the regular uh, these semiconductors ones, or you... Kind of, yeah. Else. These ones, these are all uh, 12A series, so there are like 12AX7, uh, there's some 12AU in here. Uh, the 12A series were all amplifiers, basic amplifiers, so you'll see them in guitar amps and things like that. These were taken out of machines, um, so may not have many hours left on them. Uh, but if you're building your own guitar amp, you need to test stuff before you buy a really expensive new tube. It's a good way to start. And it's also something that a lot of people can pick up and say, this is what we used before we had cell phones. Can you imagine a cell phone built out of all of these? Yeah. Well, thank you so much. Thank you.